Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video and welcome back to League 2 Predictions. Um, just before I get started, this video is sponsored by LOL T-Shirt Company. Um, you may have heard of them before, they have done a new deal with me, um, you know, to uh, do my merch. So please feel free, after this video, go check it out and maybe get some for your kids for Christmas. Um, but anyway guys, you know what I do, so guys, you know what to do, subscribe for more, thanks for watching, and let's go. So the first game we're going to talk about is Lake Norian versus Colchester. Um, Lake Norian beating Cambridge 3-2 away from home, great three points for Lake Norian there. Um, Colchester beat Carlisle 3-0. Um, Lake Norian are now sitting in 15th place, 25 points. Um, Cambridge sitting at level still with 28 points. Um, Colchester, 8th, um, 1 point behind Northampton Tail for the playoff places. Um, yeah, this game's going to be a bit of an interesting one. Um, Lake Norian 15th, as I've said, um, 25 points, so uh, it's not too far off the player places. Um, Colchester are going to go on and win in this one. The game, they've got a game in hand on North Hampton Town as well, so to keep the pressure on them. But as far as this result goes, I'll go for a 2-1 Colchester win. My next one is Carlisle versus Bradford. Bradford 1-1 one, one at home to Salford City. Carlisle losing 3-0 away to Colchester. Um, Bradford sitting in 5th, 36 points, 2 points off of crew who are sitting in 3rd. Um, Carlisle way down in 21st, which I'm going to go for a 3-1 Bradford win. My next one is Cheltenham Town versus Plymouth Argyle. Um, Cheltenham Town 1-1 one, one away to Port Vale. Um, probably a bit of you know, a, not a really good day for Cheltenham Town. Plymouth game was postponed to play to play Macclesfield. Um, you know why the EFL called it off, but I do not see the point in calling games off. I mean, common EFL, you're saying a lot of fans not glad to see their team play. Um, Macclesfield as well got a six points deduction. Um, but all the wrong steps I think the EFL are taking. Let them play the football, take some money off the gate if that's what the problem is. But as far as this result goes, Plymouth in ninth, Cheltenham in fourth, and I'm going to go for a one all scoreline for that one. My next one is Crawley Town versus Northampton Town. Um, Crawley Town loses 2 1 away to Oldham. Um, Northampton Town 1 1 away to Ma uh, Mansfield. Disappointed day for Northampton Town. Um, Northampton Town are currently sitting in 7th. Um, Crawley 18th, you know, probably. Um, a bit of disappointed day for Crawley playing against Oldham. Probably needed the three points, if I'm all honest. Um, but a uh, shelves the point. But as far as this result goes, I'll go for a 2 1 Northampton Town win. My next one is Exeter versus Newport County. Um, Newport County 2 1 away losers to Morecambe. Exeter 3 3 at home to Walsall. 
Um, you know, disappointed day for Exeter as well. Um, I think this is going to be one of the interesting games on Boxing Day. Um, but I'm going to go for a 2-2 scoreline for that one. My next one is Macclesfield versus Grimsby. Please let this one go ahead. Um, Macclesfield game got postponed. Told you about it. Grimsby losing 1-0 at home to Scunthorpe. As I said, I don't see the advantages of EFL calling games off. Um, they're in financial trouble. If they sort of money thing that they only have out, take it off the gate. Do not do another Berry and Bolton. And, I mean, because otherwise this is going to be a current thing. I know it's hard in League 2 and I know it's hard because of the fair play rules, but come on EFL, help the clubs out. It's your baby. Unfortunately, I can't see the EFL lasting for the next 20, 30 years. Um, I think it will be a big struggle. Um, Grinsby, 1-0 losers away to Scunthorpe. And Grinsby currently sitting in 20th and Scunthorpe all the way up to 12th. And the reason I say all the way up to 12th, because I, I know it's not far off and I sit in, in the bottom um, three, I think it was, bottom three, bottom two. Um, but as far as this result goes, if it goes ahead, I'll go for a 1-0 Grimsby win. My next one is Mansfield versus Port Vale. And Port Vale, 1-1 at home to Cheltenham Town. Mansfield, 1-1 at home to Northampton Town. Um, so both of these teams are going in with a point of peace. Um, Port Vale... In the top half in 10th, Mansfield are 17th with 23 points. Um, this game, I'm going to go for a 2-1 Port Vale win. My next one is Morku versus Oldham. Um... Oldham, 2 1 winners away, um, sorry, at home against Crawley Town. Um, Morecam beating Newport County 2 1 at home as well. So both of these teams started with three points for the previous weekend. Obviously, it cannot happen again because um, both teams are playing each other. Both close in the table, so I'm going to go for a 1 0 scoreline for that one. My next one is Salford City versus Crew Alexander. Crew are currently in third and Salford are 14 with 26 points. Um, this game is going to be another interesting one. Um, obviously Salford 1-1 one, one away to Bradford. The week had just gone. Um, and Crew Alexander beating Stevenage 5-1 away from home. Um, great result for Crew Alexander. Um, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm trying to think how to call this one. Um, I go, uh, I'll go 2-1 Crew Alexander win. Um, my next one is Scumthorpe versus Walsall. Um, Scunthorpe beating Grimsby Town 1-0 away from home. Walsall drawing 3-3 away to Exeter. Um, this game, um, I'll go for a 2-2 scoreline for that one. My next one is Stevenage versus Forest Green. Um, Stevenage won, uh, lost 5-1 at home to Crew Alexander. Um, Forest Green, 2-2 at home to Swindon Town. Um, Forest Green are currently in 6th. Uh, Stevenage, 
or bottom of the league with 16 points. Um, which one will go for a 3 nil Forest Green win? My last one for this weekend is Swindon Town versus Cambridge United. Um, Swindon Town 2-2 two -two away to Forest Green. Uh, don't have a bad point for Swindon if I'm all honest. Cambridge losing 3 2 at home to Lake Norian. Um, this point, day for Cambridge. Swindon sitting top of League 2 nicely, which one will go for a 2 0 Swindon Town win. But anyway, guys, have a nice Christmas. Um, if you're going out, please be safe. Don't forget my merch. Link is down in the description below. But guys, give us a big thumbs up if you enjoy it. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Ciao for now.